is Venkatesh. Welcome back to AccountSky.net Style ERP9 Tutorial. And in this video, I am going to show you how to make use of the checkbook while making the payment opportunity. And here, I have already configured the checkbook for Axis Bank. Hence, I am making a payment voucher using the Axis Bank ledger. And I have already shown you how to create a checkbook in my earlier videos. And suppose I am making the payment for one of the suppliers, print systems. Suppose I am making payment towards the suppliers, 25,000. Here I can see the payments to suppliers. Here I am going to make the payment to only suppliers. Hence I am selecting the range. Tally ERP9 will automatically assign the lost checklist which is not yet used by you. Suppose if suppose if you provide already used check number 81, 81 check is already been used, hence it will show error message that the checkbook has already been used and it will let not allow you to use that checklist. And in, a, in another payment voucher, I would like to make the payment for the electricity bill. Suppose electricity bill that is 2500 rupees. Here. I would like to select the checkbook. Here, this checkbook is only for making the payments to suppliers. Then, I have to select another checkbook, either that I have created. Otherwise, I can go with the not applicable range. Here, I provide as 095650. As this check leaf only should be used for the supply purpose, it tells the user that checkbook must be used for the payments to suppliers and this way the checkbook will help you while making the payment voucher to the particular group of persons and a particular group of payments and this is how we can use the checkbook while making the payment vouchers regarding the whether we are going to making the payment to that particular group of persons have a particular group of transactions we can recognize with the help of the checkbook and thanks for watching this video have a nice day signing off your Vankatesh